Hey everyone, this is Tony LeBron with Uplift TV and we are here at NRB, the National Religious Broadcasters Convention. And I have with me a very special guest, Josh Enk. He is the President and Chief Creative Officer of Sight and Sound Theater, which is located in, in Branson and also in Lancaster, Pennsylvania. And so, and this was started by your father-in-law. Yeah, my father-in-law and his wife, uh, yeah. my mother-in-law, Glenn and Shirley, they were dairy farmers in Lancaster County. Okay. And they went from producing milk to producing epic <laughs> Bible stories on stage and now we're the largest faith-based theater in the world. The core of what we do is for spectacle and story to, to meet mm -hmm. and for people to have a, a life-changing experience to be able to relate to, to characters of the Bible that they weren't ever really re able to relate to before. Right. So that's been the most exciting thing is, uh, you know, becoming more relevant to people in places where, you know, I've heard that story before. Absolutely. Well, they haven't seen it like this before. Absolutely. So right now you're running the story of Moses and Branson and Samson in Lancaster, Pennsylvania. Tell me about the story of Moses. And wow, yeah. Well, Moses is something close to my heart because yes. I had a chance to, to be on the, the co-writing of that and then directing the show. Right. The thing that really changed the game for us with Moses, uh, which became a, a record year for us at Sight and Sound, was people didn't think they could ever relate to Moses before. Yeah. You know, they always imagined Charlton Heston yes. with the beautiful white Let hair. And, yeah, 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 yeah. Breaking the Ten Commandments. And I love the Ten Commandments, yeah. and I love Charlton Heston, but that wasn't the Moses that I found when I was writing and producing the show. I found the Moses that was orphaned at age five, okay. who had a speech impediment, wow. anger issues, wow. killed wow. a man, right, right. ran away from God, yes. even named his kids, you know, names that meant I'm a stranger in a strange land. That's the Moses that we stage. And when we do that in a spectacular way, people are changed. That's amazing. And that's what we do with all these stories. Noah and Samson and Jonah and Daniel. Sight and Sound Theater, as he's talking, it makes me want to book a flight to Branson and watch <laughs> Moses. Um, Josh, thank you for the work that you're doing. Um, more information, get tickets if they're in town. Yeah, they Tony, they can go to sight-sound.com. Okay. Uh, that's where they can get everything. It's a one-stop shop there for everything you want about Sight and Sound. We have DVDs of our shows okay. as well. Uh, but when you're in Lancaster or Branson, the ticket's on me, Absolutely. all right? Absolutely. Okay, I'll hold you to that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thanks so much, man. You bet.